it's a great day for a drive, especially in a 2017 T350 Transit. This has got a high roof and it has a 3.5 liter V6 engine, automatic transmission, and it's a rear wheel drive. It also has a reverse camera and the previous owners have put in flooring as well as a cupboard and a shelf so you're sort of ready to either do some work or play in there and it also has a trailer tow hitch really easy to take this vehicle out on a test drive you can book that online at islandford.ca stay tuned we're going to have a look under the hood and inside and out as well as power locks, windows, and mirrors. The driver's seat and passenger seat are manually adjusted and they both have armrests. And there's your window, or yes, your window controls, lighting controls, and there's a step making it easier to get in. And then on the face of the steering wheel, you have your menu for your dash, cruise control, hands-free dialing, as well as your volume. And when we start up the vehicle, you're going to see any important messages, your odometer reading, and that menu will come up as well. And then you can toggle through to the different options. So we're seeing the kilometers to empty and the reset there, the odometer reading, temperature, excuse me. And it just goes around and you have the menu in there. And then in our display screen in the center here, it's got the temperature outside as well as the time and the date. You've got your CD player, your radio. So the radio would show in there for your different options and your media as well you've got your tuner and your hazard lights and we can turn the radio on and off from here as well and when we put the vehicle in reverse we're going to see our backup camera view and so the green yellow red is just showing us how close we are to other objects or vehicles when we are going in reverse so i'm just going to put us back into park and then down below we have our fan have our AC, max AC, 12 volt, there's a USB, little cubby to put things, as well as cup holders, 12 volts, you've got your automatic select shifter, and then you have the glove compartment, there's a couple of bins there, you put bottles or whatever, handles, your lighting controls are up here, you also have this top shelf, you can put items up there, but you do need to be careful because they do move around when you're traveling, and you're all set. 16 inch wheels and where you're seeing the cutout is where the gas cap's located and then in the rear we have our high mount light there's also a window there and you have a trailer tow hitch and just to the left of the license plate holder is where your backup camera is located when you're ready to open it up you start off with where the handle's located just pull that and then there's a latch on the left hand side door just undo that and the owners before have or previous owners have put in this nice flooring as well as a closet a shelf there's a fan up top and some nice lighting as well as some wood on the walls and so you could use this as a camping space or maybe even a workspace and then when you're ready to close it up just close the left door first then the right you can just lock everything up and walk away or jump in and head out on your latest adventure. The nice thing with these transit vans is they have the sliding passenger door and this is on the rear passenger side and we just pull the handle, open it up and you've got that wood flooring as well as the step. There's the grab handle in the body and the pass-through between driver and passenger. Up top there's a fan as well as lighting and this is a closet that's off to this side and you can see in the back there there's the window. There's also a shelf that's just around the corner and you're ready to go. And then when you want to close it up, you just slide the door closed and you're all set. Two doors in the rear with a window and you've got a sliding passenger door. The front door has privacy glass with window vents, heated side view mirrors, halogen headlights, and many more reasons to visit us. If you like this video and would like to see more, please subscribe. We have plenty to share with you and we love to hear your comments.